Okay, so now, now on to how this works. Um, we can open our Thumb and Numicon, and we can see that we have iron, copper, and tin. We need to make copper and tin in order to make brass. So we need to see the recipe. So the recipe for three pieces of copper, and we need uh, two ingots, if I'm right. Uh, which I will do a bit more um, on trying to figure out the recipe for brass. Um, oh, what's the recipe? Give me the recipe. The recipe for brass is three copper. Three copper, one tin. Okay, so we need s nine, eighteen, something. Eighteen of these. And in order to do that, we need uh, the equivalent of three metalum and one victus. So I'll show you how that works. Uh, we have our silver nuggets, which equal one metalum because they don't have a little number next to them. And then we have. Um, we have our wheat that has the Victus, but it has two, and we would need one. Uh, so I'm pretty sure I knew of something earlier. I think it was the apples. Uh, the apples that I have in my tree. Um, okay, no, it was the melon. The melon has one, and I think the apples, no. Nope. So the perfect recipe would be three silver ingots into our crucible and one melon. So let's let's do that now. One, oops, nope. One, two, three. And then what we do is we grab our wand and we go bam, and we got our first set of copper nuggets. So, then we have to fill it with water again. Uh, I'm going to wait for it to come to a boil. And I'm going to do it again. So we go one, two, three, one. Bam. Again, one, two, three. Hey, Melon, cooperate. Okay, so we got nine. Nine of the copper ingot, uh, nuggets. And now we can make a copper ingot. And now we need three of these. Three of these and one tin to make um, the four brass ores. And our transmutation is three metal and one glass. Okay, so as you guys can see, it says metal and tells you any metals, mine, or ore, right? That will give you metal. So um, I am going to um, cut to the part where I've worked on all this stuff. And you know what? Never mind. I'm actually going to do this on screen. We have plenty of episodes. I'll cut this down as many times as I need to. So, uh, I need glass, right? So, I need three metalum, one glass. I've got four. Uh, I need three glass, technically, because I need to make three. Okay, so let's throw that up there. Let's throw this down here. Let's go grab some water. Pour it and go actually let's look into how much glass ooh that might be a lot um let me go into my thumb and number con tin
And we only need one. I figured it out. So, in order to get one of this element, we need glass panes. In order to get glass panes, we are going to need more glass. So, what I'm going to do is I'm going to uh, grab a cacti. Grab a cacti, make a trip to the sky den. Visit our friend the herbalist. Give her the cacti. She will give me the sand. So, another thing is, I hope you guys are enjoying this. I really am enjoying learning all the stuff that there has been uh, in this wonderful, wonderful series. I am very impressed with Chocolatey Syrup and his ability to make a map that is so compelling and just such a great just a great map to play it's it gives a new element to um, to minecraft that you you don't usually get and so I think that's enough for pains yep cool so I'm gonna throw three of these one two three bam and hit it with the uh, Again, let's do this again. Start boiling. I don't need any more. So one, two, three. Because from what I understand, the reason I want the exact recipes is because if you use any other type of recipe, um, or if you use over the amounts, the rest of it gets thrown into the atmosphere and I don't I'm pretty sure I remember them saying it has some sort of negative effect on the the environment and I don't want that so looks like we have our first piece of tin and we have one copper so let's throw the copper and the tin in there I'm going to need more copper and before we had the glass panes what did I have here again I had wow I need my thumbnomicon I had melon melon come here come here melons the best part is once we yield these melons they're ours all of it and they'll just keep uh, like I don't have to replant more seeds so so we have water and what I might do just for this part is probably fast forward to this part so um, bear with me Alright guys, I've got all the copper we need in order to make brass. And what we need to do is we need to make an alloy furnace, I think, in which we will need bricks, if I am correct. So, uh... So that I'll leave for another episode, but what we're going to do to finish off this episode today is we're going to make our four night ore and our four alimentium. So uh, let me look up my recipes again. And so we need for alimentium coal and cobblestone. Um, or actually, why am I looking at something external when I have the recipes right here? So the night ore for Ignis six lux and four potentia so let us look up those are two ignis two potentia and six lux so we need six torches we need six torches in order to make one 
aluminium and two pieces of coal. So what I need is I'm going to need more. And we can always make more coal after, but what I'm going to do is I'm going to throw this into my inventory, throw these down here. I'm going to go and I'm going to fast forward through making this as well. So stay tuned and we will have Elementium very soon. Alright guys, we have the four night ore, and that was essential to our next quest, so uh, let's go, let's look up the, um, uh, let's fill our cauldron, or our crucible, sorry, and uh, look into our Thumbonomicon and see how we make the Elementium. So we need uh, three Fractus, we need six Ignis, and six Potentia, so uh, we need three pieces of coal, and we need... Uh, Fractus we got from cobblestone, right? Uh, and we need, did I say, three cobblestone. Um, so, before I go any forward, I want to see if there is anything that just has one Fractus. And that's cobblestone. Okay, so, we're going to fast forward through this as well, but, um... Um, I will see you guys actually no I need more coal so let's cut down some trees we're gonna need a bit more coal and uh, the only way to get our coal our charcoal is with trees so my inventory Uh, should I cut these ones down? I'll cut this one down. And then we can go make some more beautiful, beautiful stuff. Uh, before I continue, I want to go in here. I want to throw the stuff that we no longer need in there. Um, yep, yep. Okay, so let's go grab that apple. And let's go back. We'll make some coal, uh, some charcoal. I'll probably cut to when it's finished. Um, make some charcoal. And, um, and then we'll make our elementium. And then, uh, in the meantime, while I wait for our charcoal I'm going to look up how to make brick or an alloy furnace alright guys I'm back and I'm going to be starting my little um, venture into making uh, the the um, what do you call it? The blah blah alimentium. So again, we need three fractus, so three cobblestone and three torches in order to make one. So now we've got our water boiling. I'm going to toss in one, two, three. Then we got one two three awesome bucket of water let's do this four more times gotta wait till that boils so now it's boiling we go one two Three, two, three. 
So the reason why I'm wasting more of each is because every time I put it in, I have to wait for it to make that specific sound. Uh, the, the crunching or loud smacking sound or whatever we want to call it. So we're just waiting for it to boil up proper. So that's a bit of a bubble. So one, two, three. One, two, three. Hit it with our wand. We're good to go. One more time. Wait for it to boil. Go to the sky den, say hi to Fritz. Hi Fritz. Come back. One, two, three. One, two, three. Awesome. Now we've got four night R, four elementium, and we're gonna need four brass, but I need an alloy furnace. And so uh, I'm going to end this episode off here so I can do a little bit more research on how to create an alloy furnace or how to get clay in order to um, create the alloy furnace um, because the alloy furnace is made of bricks uh, and there's no way to get bricks right now. So um, once I figure that out, I will have another episode up showing you guys and going through how to make the alloy furnace how to get the brass and finally finishing the quest that we currently have which is thumb 102 so again I want to thank you guys for watching I appreciate all your support and um, you know the regular likes comments and subscribes are always appreciated and uh, yeah thank you guys for watching again and I will see you guys